A teenager injured and taken to the hospital after kids in Grafton TP'd their high school. Police found that teenager in a field near Grafton High School. He is being treated for a serious head injury. Cody Holyoke is live in Grafton. Cody, what happened? Well, Mike, Courtney, there's a, there are a lot of questions today. You know, this is meant to be a week of fun, but homecoming celebrations here at Grafton High School now come with a lingering concern. Sure, there's some toilet paper on the trees behind me, but the bigger picture is a 16-year-old boy is sedated in the hospital after this prank behind me backfired. It's awful. I can't believe that. Parents generally understand kids will be kids, but this year's homecoming prank gave students a brush with reality. The juveniles saw the police and ran on their own accord. Late Monday night, police busted up the hijinks at Grafton High School's parking lot, and a number of teens ran off. One of them, a 16-year-old boy, fell in a field and struck his head. It was uh, very dark when they were running. They probably couldn't see where they were going. And might have tripped and fallen or didn't know the terrain. After lying in that field for hours, the teen is now at Children's Hospital. I visited the hospital this morning. Grafton superintendent visited the boy's family. They're quite shaken up, and uh, we hope the young man pulls through in flying colors. Uh, he was sedated uh, this morning. Police have issued citations, and the school district is working on punishing some of the students involved in this year's prank. But let's face it, one of those teens will likely miss out on homecoming activities this year. Administrators are hoping his friends learn to channel their energy elsewhere. I think it's kind of a reminder to everybody that bad things can happen. I kind of wondered like how people didn't realize that he wasn't with them anymore. The mood in class was a somber one. Students have a lot of questions, mindful that this prank was no laughing matter. I don't think it's a cool idea to go around and throw toilet paper all over trees. I think it's really dumb. Now, today, I was able to reach out to the teen's parents. Understandably, they don't want to talk right now. They're tending to their son as he lies in a hospital bed. Now, students, though, are pressing on. Homecoming week here at Grafton High School will continue as planned. Reporting live in Grafton, Cody Holyoke, today's TMJ4. Yeah, let's hope he makes a full recovery. Thanks, Cody.